Dear future international students, if you received your previous education outside of Russia, then in order to become a student at Lamanosov Moscow State University, your foreign education must be recognized as corresponding to the educational program implemented in the Russian Federation. Recognition of foreign education and or qualifications is conducted free of charge in electronic form in the automated information system of Moscow State University recognition on the online portal recognition.msu.ru. In this video, we will explain how to work in our information system recognition in order to successfully upload all the documents and apply for recognition of documents on education. Recognition of foreign education and or qualifications is a prerequisite for admission to Lomonosov Moscow State University. Our university conducts the recognition procedure independently and also accepts the results of recognition received at the main state center for education evaluation. To start the recognition procedure, it's necessary to prepare a set of documents. A valid identity document with which you plan to cross the border of the Russian Federation for the purpose of studying. Document on previous education and its supplements. A document confirming the change of surname, name or patronymic if they do not match those indicated in the document on education and in the current identity document. Documents received in a foreign country must be legalized. You can familiarize yourself with the rules of legalization of documents issued in your country in the Our Platform Recognition in the Reference Information section. All documents issued in a foreign language must be accompanied by a notarized translation into Russian. The recognition process begins with your registration in the information system recognition. You will need to fill in personal data, applicant profile data, and upload electronic copies of your identity documents and education documents to the system. After that, it will be necessary to send a request to experts to check their correctness and completeness of the documents. Our experts will consider your request, form a set of documents necessary for the recognition of education or write what changes to make if the submitted documents are incorrect. The results of the preliminary decision on the recognition of your education will be reflected in the express expertise. In the case of a positive preliminary decision, you will be allowed to take entrance examination for admission to Moscow State University. After successfully passing these examinations, you will need to submit to the admissions committee of the faculty to which you entered the original documents uploaded to the information system recognition, which were included in the set of documents created for you by the expert. If all original documents match the uploaded electronic copies, a final positive decision will be made on the recognition of your education. The information system recognition will help you understand what information you need to enter in a particular field and what files to upload. Using the buttons in the upper left corner of the screen, you can select Russian, English or Chinese for displaying field names and instructions in the portal interface. At the same time, entering information into the system is allowed only in Russian. Data must be entered in accordance with a notarized translation of documents into Russian language. 
The first time you access the system, you need to register. Enter your valid email address and create an easy to remember password consisting of uppercase and lowercase letters and symbols. Do not forget to give your concern to the processing of personal data of the recognition system user. A link for verification will be sent to the email address you provided when registering. To confirm your email address, just wait for email and enter the code which we sent to you in the form on the IES recognition portal page or follow the link provided in the email. For the second and subsequent authorizations in the system, you will need to sign in to your personal account using the email address and password you entered while registration. The first step is to fill in the applicant form. We remind you that the fields of the form should be filled in Russian. After filling out the application form, the system will prompt you to enter data in the Profile and Account Settings section. Please don't forget to upload your photo. In the next step, the system will direct you to the Personal Data page. Data entry begins with the indication of the country of citizenship. Uh, please be reminded that you, if you have several citizenships, one of which is Russian, have the right to enter and study at Moscow State University only as a citizen of the Russian Federation. Next, you need to enter the details of a valid identity document and upload a file with its electronic copy. At the next stage, you need to enter information about your education documents into the system. After clicking the New Document button in the upper right corner, a window with a document card will open. When filling in the first section, you must indicate the country in which you received your education. After saving the data, you get in to the next session. At this step of filling in the data in the information system recognition, you must enter information about your educational institution and the received document on education. At the third step, you need to upload electronic copies of the document on education, supplements to it and their translations into Russian. If, at the time of filling in the data, you do not yet have a document on education in your hands, you can provide a certificate indicating the date of graduation and the date of the diploma awarding. The final recognition of education can be carried out only if an electronic copy of the received documents on education is uploaded to the system. At the fourth stage, you will see a page with the data you entered. If you see an arrow, you can always go back to the previous step and make corrections. Do not forget to verify the data and save your work. If you have not yet uploaded all the necessary documents, you can return to editing the education document card until you send a request for the document verification to experts. If you have more than one education document that you would like to include in your request for verification, you can create a separate card for each of them. If all necessary documents are entered into the system, feel free to select the Send a Request for Verification option. 
In the window that opens, you will see the data you entered. Please check them carefully and select from the list at the bottom of the page the education documents that you want to include in the verification request. After submitting the request, you will no longer be able to make corrections to the fields of the form or delete selected documents. All requests sent for verification are saved in your personal account. Here you can track their status and see expert comments on uploaded documents. The experts will also prepare for you a set of documents necessary for applying for the recognition of a foreign education for admission to Lomonosov Moscow State University. You will also see the created sets of documents in your personal account in a separate section. You will receive notifications of all changes occurring in the IS recognition system, including the corresponding information will be sent to you by email. You can view notifications by clicking on the bell at the top right corner of the screen. We have provided convenient tools for you to communicate with MSU experts. If you have already submitted a request for verification and would like to clarify the information related to this request, send your question to an expert through the window in the Communication with an Expert tab in the verification request card. If you have a general question, send it to our specialists by clicking on the Support Requests button uh, in the upper right corner of the screen. At any time, you can see in your personal account the requests you have created, as well as the answers to them from the experts. In your personal account, in the desktop session, you can see your verification requests, check the status of their processing and also in the event log tab see what actions were performed in the AIS recognition system. Pay attention to the menu item on the left side of the screen reference information. Here you will find useful information about working in the AIS recognition system, about the procedure for recognizing foreign education at Lomonosov Moscow State University, including answers to frequently asked questions. The results of consideration of verification requests is a preliminary expert decision, express expertise. You can see the results in the Result of Request Processing tab in the Verification Request card. Here you will see at what level of education you can enter Moscow State University, get information about the deadlines for submitting an application for admission, see comments on the created set of documents if it needs to be improved. In the case of positive expert expertise, you can be admitted to taking entrance examinations and participation in the competition for admission to the Lomonosov Moscow State University. After successfully passing the exams, check in your personal account that you have taken into account all the comments of the experts on the set of documents and made all the necessary corrections. The procedure for the recognition of education can be completed provided that you, in person or by mail, have submitted the original documents on education to the admissions committee of your faculty. You will see the final results of the recognition of your foreign education and or qualifications in your personal account. Dear future international students, Requests for verification and recognition of foreign education can be submitted to the Moscow State University system AIS recognition on the portal recognition.msu.ru throughout the year. 
if you are planning to start your studies next academic year, we recommend that you do not postpone sending your requests for verification of documents until late spring, but do it as early as possible. We will contact you, answer your questions and provide assistance so that you can get all the documents necessary for admission in advance and focus on preparing for the entrance exams. We wish you success and see you at Lomonosov Moscow State University next academic year.